Hi, here is Marc Dubois from Herotech. I am presenting here the third pre-release video on a toolkit to interface LabVIEW with the Microsoft HoloLens. This video presents an example of possible application in the field of non-destructive testing. A phased array delay calculator and ray tracer application called HaroUT has been developed by Herotech using LabVIEW. Here, result previously calculated for a dual probe on a 5-inch diameter pipe with 3 quarter of an inch walls are being loaded. Once the results are loaded, the ultrasonic rays can be displayed in 2D for different planes and for different skew angles and for color angles. The calculation result can also be displayed in 3D using a LiveView 3D picture control. Similarly to the 2D case, the calculated ultrasonic rays can be displayed from different points of view for the various focal law angles and skew angles. The previous Aerotex videos on the HoloLens toolkit showed that once 3D objects were created for a LiveView 3D picture control, the same 3D objects can easily be uploaded into the HoloLens using Aerotex's soon to be released toolkit. After starting the HoloLens application, for user convenience, the display parameters of the Hauro UT application are controlled by a tablet. The tablet application was developed and tied to the Hero UT application using National Instrument Data Dashboard. The HoloLens has sensors to stabilize the virtual 3D objects, or holograms, in the actual environment. The green cursor moves to the first actual surface in the line of sight of the user. Air tapping without loading the calculations simply highlights actual surfaces as mapped by the HoloLens where the green cursor lays. The surfaces mapped by the HoloLens are a link between the virtual and actual world. They can be used to align virtual 3D objects with actual objects, like here for the virtual pipe used for calculations with an actual 5-inch diameter pipe. Once aligned, the virtual pipe can act as an X-ray showing the calculated ultrasonic rays inside the pipe wall in green. The location of a well was simulated on the actual pipe by a black tape. The corresponding virtual weld is shown here in blue. Each of the calculated beams for that particular inspection can be selected using the tablet. The virtual pipe can be scaled up for better visualization of the setup and of the ultrasonic beams. Virtual defect can also be added, shown here as orange squares at the current ultrasonic beam focal point. In the present example, the virtual defects are added using the tablets. However, in the case of a real inspection, the virtual display could be linked to an actual inspection and the presence of a virtual defect could be automatically determined using the actual ultrasonic amplitude or time of flight data. The virtual pipe inspection setup and results can be scaled back down to the size of the actual pipe, showing that the overall alignment was maintained. Please provide feedbacks, comments, ideas, or suggestions at the bottom of this video, or by going to the 3D Vision or Ultrasonic National Instrument Virtual Groups, or by going at harotech.com. Thank you for watching.